I was driving home today and I saw this. I just spent half an hour on the phone to Orange convincing them this big pile of organised rubble behind me is actually a home with an address that exists. The problem is the phone pole that's in front of my car was hit by a tractor who was trying to work its way around between the pole and the electric line and really wasn't going to fit. And sometime today the fibre was yanked off the next line up and I suppose they hit the pole again. And um, yeah, I've reported the two phone poles for have that fixed. It doesn't help that my neighbours are dickheads who don't know how to drive a sodding tractor. Anyway, this. A uh, colleague at work gave me this. She said it works fine to heat up, but it doesn't mix. Now I'm thinking broken belt, so let's plug it in, put it on the dough setting, which is number eight there, what is it, menu? There you go. You hear the motor turning. Uh, it sounds like it's carrying on spinning afterwards, so yeah, I'm probably going to go with a broken drive belt. Because it, it actually takes quite a bit of oomph to turn this thing to uh, make bread. So let's sweep it over and uh, have a look inside. I brought out my fancy screwdriver set because I bet this is going to have annoying screws. What is it first? Really deeply recessed crosshairs. Hang on, let me go get a uh, deeper screwdriver for that. Actually, before I begin, if you look there, it looks like this bit's a drive belt, so that probably is a good call. Them into a lid. One there. Aha, stupid screws. So, what size stupid screw are you? Will that do you? Yeah, that'll do. If they think it's supposed to be childproof, they never met this child. Usually there's arcane ways to unclip this thing, so hang on while I figure out how to get it open. I cheated and took the heat shield out. So you can see what's going on inside. Some flaps there to undo. And now to take it apart even more. These things are not designed to be fixed. And finally, here is the truth. You would have thought that the drive belt being like the weakest part would have, I don't know, some sort of way of accessing it that didn't involve a complete strip down. I have a spare drive belt, but it's way too small, so I've... I'll just stick the pieces back in the bag for now and uh, keep that on the magnetic thing. And I think the belt will come in maybe a week, a week and a half. I suppose it depends on whether it's coming from France or China.